Hey everyone, um, it is Thursday, December 1st, 2011. This is Hydrocephalus video blog number two. Um, this is just kind of to give you guys a look into uh, what you have to do when you're in the hospital for 10 to 14 days, which is basically wait. Um, and this is our room. Layla's watching her Dora the Explorer. And this, this is Layla. Can you say hi? Say hi. This is little Layla. She has her metal crib that they use. This is her IV. She is on two different types of antibiotic. She has a pick line here in her arm. Oh. She has an ace bandage wrapped around her head um, right now, basically to uh, keep her from pulling out the EVD, the external ventricular drain, because she um, she actually ended up ripping out five of her sutures that was holding it, um, suture to her head, holding it in place. She ripped it out in her sleep. Um, over here, yes. this is the external ventricular drain. You see, right here is nothing more than cerebral spinal fluid. This is where it drains to. And this measures how much they dump it each hour so they can keep an eye on it. This part right here has to stay in line with the hurt ear. Um, it all works by gravity, so they basically um, have to keep this in line with her ear so that way they can measure how much at what level. Um, so yeah, this is this is her room. This is uh, what we do. This right here is uh, the incision, as you can see, where they pulled the shunt from her head. She's had that cut, that spot cut open now four times. And then this, hopefully you can see it, is uh, the drain. It comes out the back of her head. And there's some sutures here. Um, so she has been drinking a lot of Pedialyte because she won't eat. She's also on the IV fluids up there that they mix with her antibiotics. Again, just um, a short video to kind of inform everybody of what you do while you're here in the hospital. Look forward to uh, video blog number three. Again, think of Layla. Thanks, guys.